everyone. Thank you so much for checking out Crafty Little Rosebud here on YouTube. Today we are doing a plan with me for my February monthly in the Happy Planner Socialite Planner. We're also going to plan the February monthly in the um, Super Mom Planner as well. So I've got this kit from Cactus Paper Co. that I'm going to use and then I've got this Erin Condren sticker book that we will be using. So I did go ahead and lay out the date dots because that always takes so much time and I don't like trying to do it on camera. Um, I also lay numbers in the wrong places if I try while talking. So here is the kit. Um, we will have to do some cutting because I believe it's for an Erin Condren. Um, but I have gotten a lot better about making these work, so we're just going to go with it. So I'm going to go ahead really quick and I am going to cut midway into Wednesday and leave that off of this. So, and I always cut it a little crooked, can't help it, but it works out just fine. So we're actually going to leave Wednesday set aside for a minute and get Sunday through Tuesday laid out. And it generally does have to go down a little bit further, but that's perfectly fine for this side. I don't have any date dot down yet. And I might have needed to hold off on my date dots over here. Um, so let's see if I can get those peeled up. So, and I can't remember if her paper is supposed to be removable, but luckily that removed pretty well. So next, I'm going to go ahead and lay Wednesday down. Which I didn't cut it quite long enough, but that'll be fine. So then I'll just kind of line this up as best as possible. And the longer the strip, the harder it is to do this. So it's not going to line up perfectly, but that's fine. So then I will lay this out and get my um, scraper tool. I like to use my scraper tool to kind of line it up here and tear the page or the sticker. Sometimes I do it kind of crooked though. So pretty good though. And then I just cut off the little um, wonky edge that I just tore and I will use this sticker over here as some deco. So, cause I don't really love this little pink banner anyways, where it says task or to do's or whatever it said there. So I just cover that up. And then I did go ahead and lay out three bars. Those are going to be my social media stats. So I'll do my Etsy sales, my Instagram followers, and my YouTube subscribers down there. So then with this kit, we have bill dues, which I don't use in this view. Um, I do a budget planner separately. I do need to lay these two date dots back down. All right, so we've got President's Day right there. And I guess I shouldn't have laid my date dots out first. Usually I think to do them last and that's been working. But with the holiday being right there at the top, that was not going to work. So I will put the 18 back on just right there. Then um, Valentine's Day, I'm probably going to have to pull that sticker up as well. And Super Bowl, I don't know when it is. I only keep track of it when we're going to a party, and that's just for the food, personally. Um, I'm not a sports person, so 
I'll just uh, probably tape that into this monthly view, and once I figure out when Super Bowl Sunday is, I will add that sticker in if we decide to go to an event for Super Bowl. So this is what's left on that page. I am gonna go ahead. One birthday sticker for me is not enough in February. We have four, no, five birthdays in my family, but I'm going to use this sticker specifically for my daughter's birthday. Her party will probably be on the Saturday before, but I will use that to mark her second birthday. Then we've got all of this. Um, I will take this birthday one and make a list and the check boxes I'll probably hang on to and use in the monthly or not in the monthly view in the weekly view when we have um, when I have a kit that matches it so I'm just gonna put birthdays right there and I'll just list those and that's all I'm gonna use from this kit like I said this will work with some other things we've got going on so that is what's left of that and this is my layout for the monthly view of February then um, we'll go ahead and I will get out the super mom and we will lay out what I'm going to use from the Erin Condren sticker book and I did already start walk, uh, writing some things out in there. Um, I know I want a girls' night out for my birthday since my birthday is right after my daughter's. I've got planning her party. And then down here, I've got note of her birthday. So I'm going to use the third edition from the Erin Condren book. Um, I used um, some of the this for January. And I'm just going to kind of do something similar for February. So I've got a Happy Valentine's Day sticker here that I'm going to use. I did that so it covered up what was already in there. Then I'm going to do the washi across the top and bottom like I did last time. Um, and this is just to add a little bit more deco to also use up the stickers I have. And I just uh, don't want to lay out a full kit because I need to keep the room here for all the habit tracking and things I want to track. That is the whole point of this um, is to kind of track um, appointments to track. Well, actually, appointments probably won't even go here. I'll probably more so be tracking things like... Actually, it's tracking things um, such as when we mowed the lawn, when we changed out the hand towels in the bathroom, different things like that that sometimes you're like, oh, uh, when did I last do that? Um, cleaning the microwave because I don't do it every single week. Different things like that that you just don't track on a very regular basis. But, I mean, some people might track it better than me. I know I personally am bad about tracking those things. So having a planner dedicated to it really helps. Okay, so I've got the little, like, washi type strips laid out just to add a little extra to this. And then um, here's what all I've got left on the page. So I might lay some of this out just to kind of take up more space. Let's see. I really like the two um, decorative boxes. So I think we will put maybe this one down here. Actually. Yeah, I'll go ahead and put it down here. So got that, and then I'm going to pull the other one, put it at the top just to add a little something extra. So that doesn't look so bare in those empty spots. I won't even be tracking things. And then, um, 
see, we've got this beautiful heart here. Where do I want to put it? I'll just go ahead and put it right here. Again, just trying to add a little bit more color to these pages. And so I've still got lots left I can use in other spreads or whatnot, but that way I'm finally using up some of this um, because I feel like I just keep accumulating them and not using enough. So I really like this little XO. Put it right there. So there we go. Not too um, much laid out, but enough to add a little bit of decoration to the already pretty well decorated page. So that's all I got for you tonight. Now I've got both my February monthlies planned out and I am ready to go. So thank you so much for hanging out and I hope you have a great day. Bye.